Hey you guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl T back again with another video. So as you guys can tell, we are in the kitchen. So what's that mean? Yeah, another cooking vlog. So anywho, it's dinner time and we are about to make stuffed peppers, but not just your regular stuffed peppers. I know you guys probably use like tomato sauce and stuff in your stuffed peppers, but I don't do it like that. I'm going to show y'all exactly how I do it. But if this is your first time here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. Turn on all your post notifications so you do not miss any time that I upload. And yeah, y'all, we are on the way to 100K. We just hit 60K. Like, like, around this time last year, I was under 1,000 subscribers. Like, look at where we at. Like, I love the growth. Thank y'all so much for supporting me and Elijah. Like, I freaking adore y'all. Once we get to that 100K, oh, I'm giving a big giveaway. So y'all, spread, spread it, spread it, spread it, spread it. Spread the word to my channel so we can hit it and so I can give back how I want to really truly give back. I know y'all been waiting like, oh, is she ever going to give back? Is she ever going to give back? When I hit that 100K, oh, I'm, I'm giving back big. So, um... Yeah, spread the word so we can continue to grow. And without further ado, let's get right into this video. So I have all my ingredients over here. This is like, those are all my seasonings and stuff right here that I'm going to season the rice with. And then we have the dirty rice mix. You can use whatever type of dirty rice mix you want, but I use the Zatarians. Um, we're going to use the rest of this onion so it doesn't go bad. We got some Jimmy Dean uh, sausage. This is the regular kind. Normally, I get the sage, but I could not find it. Like, I haven't been able to find it nowhere. But if you can find sage, get the sage. It's so fire. So, we got that. And then we got some peppers. I think I'm going to do one of each. Um, Elijah's not going to eat the pepper, but we just going to do it for the aesthetic, okay? <laughs> and then I'm going to um, put an extra one in there so that way I can have one for lunch tomorrow. I already got my water on the stove, so I'm about to turn that on, actually, because I'm going to boil those peppers so it can soften up a little bit. And I got my pan right here on the stove, so we finna just get busy. Oh, I need a knife. So, yeah, y'all. I hope you guys are enjoying these videos as much as I am enjoying making them for you. I told y'all I'm back. And I'm going to be posting like never before like do y'all love that or what so we're gonna squeeze that up in here yeah we finna ground this up but we're gonna cut up some onion too and ground it with it lord what is that okay All right, y'all, so it's voiceover T here, and like I said, we're going to go in and just dice us up an onion. This part is optional. You guys do not have to add the onion. Normally, if I'm just making the rice, I would dice up an onion and some peppers, but since we're making stuffed peppers, I didn't dice up any peppers at all. I just did the onion, and then once you have diced up your onion, you're going to add that into the pot with your ground meat, and you're going to season with some black pepper, some onion powder, some Creole seasoning, some garlic powder, some seasoning salt, and some complete seasoning gotta have to complete and then you're just gonna chop that up and well combine that until it is to your liking and you're gonna just let that simmer on the stove until it's about done Alright y'all, I'm going to add my water in here. Okay. We're going to put our rice in. Okay. Like so, 
go like that. And we just going to mix this up. I think I have to let this boil for a little bit and then bring it to a summer for 25 minutes. Let me look at the instructions. Yeah, bring to a boil and then it says reduce to low heat. Okay. So let's get this well combined first. Comment down below what else you guys want to see me cook. I'm trying to get out my comfort zone and start doing other stuff. I'm surprised I never put this on the channel before because this is one of my favorite things to eat actually. Alright, let me find the top. Turn it down on low and let that simmer. All right, y'all, I'm gonna rinse these peppers off so they can go inside my boiling pot of water. Can y'all see that? Toys R Us right in your closet. I beg to differ. Boom, baby. y'all so the peppers are done cooking i got my little pan right here the rice is done and now we are, are about to assemble the oven is preheating so we're gonna put these bad boys up in here Okay, wait, hold on. Actually, we are going to spray this pan because I don't want it to burn. Take a little bit of water actually from here. Put it at the bottom. So just so it don't um it don't burn. Because they will burn. Okay. Let's assemble again. Put that down there. Uh oh.
cheese to the top. Just like that. Like so, like that. Put some parsley on top. Boom, baby. And we finna put these bad boys in the oven. Yeah. So dinner is done. The cheese is melted and it looks so good. So now we're about to plate the food up. And for our drinks, we will be having some mango punch. Well, Elijah will be having mango punch. And I will be having a mango Mike's Hard. And that is dinner so that is dinner so we got our pepper that is the actual vegetable and then we have our rice which is our starch and we have our meat that we cooked with our rice which is our protein so yeah y'all i hope you guys enjoyed this little video um that is it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it so much and i will see you guys all in my next video don't forget to stay safe stay blessed bye